I don't actually think that I'm that different from most people. I, I feel like I just fit in with the crowd in most ways, but it's it's pretty accepted. There's a lot of us out there these days smuggling in. It's a pretty standard thing. He shows us uh, just secretly that he's part of the community by uh, having the, the, the smuggler signal on his shop out the front here with a big Kransky on top. You get a few odd looks and occasionally, you know, a policeman might come up to you and, and have a couple of words to you about if the, if the cut's a bit high. A lot of people out there think a lot of things strange and I mean, we're all different. We all like to do different things. Dad's been my inspiration all the way, really. You know, since he was wearing the budgies around the house uh, when I was young. Yeah, Dad. Yeah, not too bad. When I first started wearing budgies, of course I had a six pack, but now I've got a simple one pack. I started out with a, just a regular pair, you know, regular shape and regular colours, but the special smugglers, a uh, special occasion ones really. Uh, Fang got them from his hometown, I believe. I know they're definitely from China. Oh, you know, I'm out with guys whenever that, that don't have the smugglers on. I have more girls coming up to me and chatting and, you know, they haven't wanted to talk to me about them and uh, quite impressed and they've always got a smile on their face. So. Once you've uh, become a budgie smuggler, uh, you just, you're into the life of freedom and just found that it's, it's been a great lifestyle for me.